Welcome to Goldberg, Ligner, and Scheister, sir. Mr. Bellick, welcome. I'll just see if Mr. Goldberg is available. Mr. Goldberg, Mr. Bellick has arrived for his interview. Okay, great. Uh, tell him to come through to my office. Would you please follow me, Mr. Bellick? Sure. Mr. Goldberg is such a saint. He teaches kids to swim, you know. He's just so warm and giving. All he cares about is making the world a better place. And boy, are you in trouble if you get in his way. Do you think you'll like me? He's just in here. Don't be nervous. He doesn't fight. Hello, Nico. What's that short for, Nikolai? I'm looking for a man who can get jobs done right. Nikolai, I like your resume. You seem to be the sort of man who would go the extra distance. I just need to take another look. Get myself reacquainted with your experience. So, you're the sort of man who doesn't wait to get told what to do. A guy who looks at the world, sees problems, and tries to fix them? Sure. My problem is that people don't notice the decay in society. They leave the decay alone, and soon it's too late, so you have to pull the whole tooth. Yeah? I am the guy who goes around shaking people. For people, read society, read city hall. I shake them, and I say floss. Get rid of the rotting flesh stuck in your teeth. Prevent decay. Mouthwash, you hear me? There's this cop. Good cop. But he thinks he's above the law. He's not. You want to know why? Because the law is clear. I'm going to crush him into dust. No one is above my judgment. You understand me? Okay. Here at GLNS, we're pushing things to the limit. We're on the front line, young man. A man I was recently with in this office, in this very room, was murdered. You got to fight for what is just in this world. You do. Anyway, give me an example of some time where you've worked as part of a team. I work alone. You gotta say something. You can't just do nothing and... You're standing. Where are the... didn't see anything, okay? You want to make me finish you off. You should run away.
luck can destroy your life. I'm Judge Grady, and this is... All about fucking 
fucking homeless shit. Not without fucking squatters' rights. But that may be so boring. You don't work, you don't live in an apartment. Pay your fucking rent like any other normal fucking American person would. Squatters' rights. I'll give you a right, I'll give you a left, and I'll give you a kick to the fucking head. Dicks. This one goes out to all of you. You're a bunch of lousy shitheads, but I love you. Shut up, punk! should have never read your fucking emails and stayed away! Please be more careful. Mr. Bellick. Just need to take another look. Get myself reacquainted with your experience. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are the files for your case against McCreary? Shit. <laughs> I was never here, you understand? Don't make me kill you. Stay down. Back three units. Oh, yeah. That's rude now, she 
Here are the files. Great. 
peace at last. I feel cleansed. You silenced Goldberg, too, right? I don't need to worry about him? He's done. Whoa, music to my ears! A weight has been lifted. Here's your payment. <laughs>